Hey guys, I'm Lena and welcome back to my channel. Today's video, as you can see, is again not a vlog. This is something very, very different which I have never done before. So today, in this video, I tried Korean ramen. <laughs> so today, me and Softy, who is a bit camera shy today, so he's sitting in the corner, are going to review five Korean ramen that I tried. So recently I went to the INA market where I found a bunch of Korean noodles and I, you know, was dil garden garden wala kind of feeling like, oh my god, I want everything. So obviously I could not get everything. So I got five of them and each of them costed me like 95 rupees, 200. Depends kya bahar, like roadside wala store se lete ho ki andar andar, andar andar thoda aur sasta mil jata hai. You can also find these Korean noodles on online websites like small Instagram pages do sell them and also in CP but the prices may vary. So I'm very excited and let's get started. So first I tried the Shin Ramen. I think many of you would have either tasted it or at least heard about it because it's a very famous Korean noodle. So I have tried Shin Ramen before but not the cup noodle version. Like I normal wala khaya, so I had to see if cup noodle is any different. But guess what? I don't think it was. First, talking about the packaging, it came in a red, glossy looking, beautiful packaging. And one fact was that it was not a plastic cup. I think it was paper, but it was a good quality cup, but it was not plastic. Another thing that in uh, most cup noodles that you get in India, they have a fork inside, but this one did not. <laughs> a very random fact, but yeah, that is how it was. <laughs> There we go, I'm gonna have my first bite. Color wise it looks very bland. But yeah, let's try. Mm. Oh. <laughs> mm. It is good. It's kind of salty. You know what? The main difference that I saw? The noodles. The noodles taste so good. Like, its texture kafi acha. So finally, I really love these noodles and I would give it a 5 on 5 because it was really good. Like, really good. And talking about the spice, since I have a low spice tolerance, I would say it's a 2.5 to 3. Like, it has, it has like the perfect amount of spice. It's not too spicy, but at the same time, not too bland. So overall, I give this a 5 on 5. Next, I tried the hot spicy chicken carbonara flavor from Samyang. The Shin Ramen was from Nongshim, I guess. This was from Samyang. Looking at the packaging, I thought it's gonna be a sweet and, you know, cheesy something. Because I thought carbonara was supposed to be cheesy and sweet, but... <laughs> guess what? I did not read that it was written hot spicy chicken. Like, I was so excited to see all the noodles. I didn't know the name of Packaging, okay, I want one green, one yellow, one this, one this, one this. Okay, I got every color. <laughs> so it comes along with a chili sauce and this cheese powder that you add. I was not sure how to make this because this was my first time. So I strictly followed the <laughs> instructions and it turned out well. Talking about the noodles, the again, the shape and the texture of the noodles was very different. I loved the shape. Texture was amazing. It was so soft and all these Korean ramen are like... The texture is so amazing, they can easily be slurped, like it's so... <sighs> Get the feeling. So my noodles are ready and they look so good and I can't wait to eat it but I'm scared because like when it's a sauce, it's a little taste kara. and it's spicy. Like when you first eat it, like when it's in your mouth, you chew it, it's so soft and sweet, like the cheese flavor. But then, oh, oh, oh. spice tolerance is like This is, but it's so tasty, like it's so tasty. So yeah, as you can see, I ended up crying as always. You're gonna see me uh, doing that in the whole video, so don't worry. It's just the beginning. <laughs> Even though it was very spicy and I could not tolerate it, but the taste was delicious. You should surely, surely, surely try this out. 
and I will give this a 515 because it deserves it. Spice for me was a 4 or maybe a 5. So next I tried this Udon Seafood Flavor Ramen from Samyang. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong. This comes with a soup base and flakes and is prepared just like we make normal Maggi. And yeah, it does look a bit bland. So I just added some green onions on top to give it that look. I'm kind of confused about this because it's very bland, like very bland. The soup is tasty but overall I would say that this was not very worth it and no seafood flavor I could taste in this. So its soup was good but the noodles didn't get that flavor in it. If you eat it together, it's fine but it's not very worth it. Like I found it a bit difficult to finish the whole bowl and I was like, kab khatam hoga. <laughs> so yeah, not a big fan of it. It was not spicy at all so it's 0 out of 5 for spice. Taste, I'll give it a 2 for the soup. Otherwise, not a big deal. Next, I tried the Bulldog Hot Spicy Chicken Cheese flavor, I guess that is what it was. It was also again from Samya. So this was also in a cup noodle version because the other one was not available. This comes with a hot sauce and a chili, sorry, cheese powder like the carbonara, carbonara one. So to make these noodles, you first put in the hot water in the cup and let the noodles without any flavor first cook. And then one very interesting thing which I liked about this was it has these small triangles towards the edges which you can poke so that you can remove the excess water which was very interesting and fascinating for me. <laughs> and then you add in the hot sauce and the cheese powder. Again, I did not know that this was also a hot spicy chicken flavor. Seeing the packaging, I thought, okay, this is going to be full cheese and white sauce kind. I don't know why, but don't go on the packaging. <laughs> they look very cute and sweet, but they are very spicy. So here are the noodles. I'm looking after all the past experience. Smell-wise, I don't like it, but let's see if I'm ready to cry today as well. So I don't know why but I think I was very hungry while I was eating this. I didn't review the I just kept on eating, eating, eating. Even though it was so spicy, I just finished it up like, like anything. <laughs> and honestly, I was very disappointed with this one because like I said, for the Shin Ramen, as I said, cup noodles, the noodle quality are not always as good. This one, I found that the noodle quality was not good. I did not like it. It was a bit chewy and not very good. Taste wise also I did not like it because it was very spicy and the taste was not good. Like for the carbonara one, it was very spicy but it tasted very good. This one, the cheese was too sweet. Like you know, sari ramen mein na, ye mirchi hai na chupi rehti hai. You first eat it, you will be like, oh, kitna meat hai. The moment you swallow it, you will feel the spice. So yeah. It was unnecessarily... Can you stop shouting these children? Pagal bachche chila rahe hain. Sorry. Bahut awaz aari hogi background mein because children are playing like hooligans. Jada ho gaya bhi. Tu bhi ek bachchi thi ek time pe. Spice, I think I would give it like a 3.5 or 4. And the taste, I would give it like a 2 because it was not worth it. And lastly, I tried the hot pepper jajang ramen, which I was most excited about. I thought I would eat the first one, but then I thought that I want to eat one with my brother. And I thought, like, just kill him, I was the excited, I'll eat that with him. So I ate this ramen with my brother. <laughs> it was quite funny, but you'll see right now. This comes uh, with a sauce, like I think the black bean, red bean, whichever jajang is. The sauce, this sauce was, uh, you know, thicker than the other sauces. 
and then it has this jajang oil and the flakes the flakes i wish i would have put it at the end on top kyunki wo fir mix hi ho gaya tha this one looked very dark and appetizing like a black color but it was worth it taaj bhaiya hamare sath test karenge jajang ramen dekhi bahut ganda lagta hai video mein aadha shakal aata hai to pehle bhai मेरे में से क्यों छीन लो भैया को क्यों पसंद नहीं आया सो दैट वॉज दाजा रामन सो दैट वर लॉर द फाइव रामन दैट आई ट्राइड इन दिस वीडियो ऑनेस्टली दिस वॉज वेरी एक्साइटिंग एंड फन टू डू टू ईट एज वेल एज टू शूट बिकॉज दिस इज समथिंग आई हैव नेवर डन बिफोर इफ यू लाइक डिट प्लीज कॉमेंट इट डाउन बिलो एंड आई माई डू अ पार्ट टू मे बी इफ दिस वीडियो गेट्स लाइक फिफ्टी लाइक्स बहुत कम मांग रही हूँ बट Even if it does not get, अगर मेरा मन करा तो I will do a part टू because मेरे को अपना पोपट नहीं करना है I would say my favorite was the शिन रामन बिकॉज इट वॉज स्पाइसी येट अ बिट टॉलरेबल इवन दो आई एंडेड अप विद मिस्टी आईज आफ्टर ईटिंग इट बट स्टिल इट वॉज टॉलरेबल द परफेक्ट अमाउंट ऑफ स्पाइस सेकेंड आई वुड से वुड बी माई कार्बोनारा फ्लेवर बिकॉज इवन दो इट वॉज सो स्पाइसी आई लव द टेस्ट आई एम गोन ट्राई दिस वन मोर टाइम third i would say will be the jajang ramen again spicy but tasty fourth and fifth uh, was seafood and the hot spicy cheese wala mujhe dono bilkul pasand nahi aaya so you can keep it at any position please give this video a lot of love cuz something new i tried i want to see if you liked it and uh, so after you want to say anything sorry he's kind of shy today okay 
and yeah that will wrap up today's video i hope you enjoyed don't forget to hit the like button share this video and subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell so that you get notified every time i'm on youtube i'll see you in my next one till then take care and bye bye